I'm joined by Lee Matheson, Style Director for Women's Day and New Zealand Women's Weekly. And I'm looking forward to this. You've got the lowdown on kids fashion and you have bought a gorgeous model. Hi, Lee. Hi, how are you? I'm very, very well. Now, tell me, first of all, hi, Asha. You've bought a special model in today to help I us out. indeed. School holiday. So I've got a school holiday aged child here with me today. Which is perfect. Yes. And he's your school He's my child. little boy. Yes. And he's gorgeous and he's been so very good. Well, let's start by talking first of all about Mother's Day. Yes. Uh, you've done a special Mother's Day shoot for Women's Day. We have indeed. Um, and so we're, we've, used, we've done a little bit differently this time. We have um, used ourselves as models, the mothers in the office, with our children just to make it a little bit special. Is this a little bragging way that you get to get your kids into a magazine? Yeah. They <laughs> want to do that, yes. wouldn't they? Oh, that sounds great. So you've got mm. all, all of you guys and yes. all your pictures. There's some pictures there. Look at that. That's right, oh, yes. Gorgeous. So we've got uh, various people through the office with their children and ageing from Asher was the youngest at five up into a 13 year old girl. So we really crossed the boundaries of what was children's wear and what's available out there. Oh, that's fabulous. And speaking yeah. of that, this is the thing a children's wear, there's shops for the children's wear. Mm -hmm. But what do you do when your kids get to the age where they don't fit the kids' stuff but they're too small for the grown ups' clothes? It's, where do you shop? It's a really, really tricky area. I mean, that's when you start to hit the department stores. So you do uh, farmers and Kmart, obviously. Shops there's like Cotton On do like really good size breaks around as well. So, so that would work well. And then, you know, kids really like streetwear. So all of those streetwear stores will have little pockets of things that will be able to fit your children. Okay, so you just got to look a little bit, sort of expand your you horizons. Have to be somewhat. creative, yeah. I've always wished that I would fit some of the kids' clothes because uh, they have such cool clothes. So cute. But yes. Unfortunately, they don't usually make them in adult sizes. Well, if, that's right, but the other, the reverse is happening now. So micro fashion is a big thing, yeah. and so that's that's a mini me trend, you know, which you see a lot with like the Beckham family. Okay. They all look the same, no matter what size they are. They do. They're mm. a beautiful family. Mm. Now, speaking of beautiful families, Asha is wearing. People are thinking, why is Asha sitting here with a jacket on? Right. Because it's not raining inside. It's not. But there is something very special that you're going to do with that jacket. That's right, Asha. Come and stand in here, darling. So this is a great new brand by the name of Firm. So they're rain jackets for kids, and then something really exciting happens when you spray it. So what happens, Asha? What have we got here? We've got a magical print that appears. And what's on the print? Dragon. Is it dragon? Can I have a look, Asha? Wow, Ooh. I can see that. That's actually really subtle. Yes. That's really fun. So when it rains, you get a dragon all over your jacket. That's right. And so kids love anything that's sort of functional and fun, you know. Yep. So anything that well, he's about to spray us all. So any, <laughs> anything, anything. Get mum, Asha. Exactly. Get mom. <laughs> anything that has a little gimmick to it, the kids love. Okay. Also got these great little shoes. This was a request from me. I wanted you to bring in some sparkly shoes that do something. So we've got sparkly shoes. Not only are they sparkly, uh, but they also light up when they get when when you're walking and we've um, got a different pair i can do those you ones. show me those ones hey. it comes glow it does indeed and the boys get the shoes as well because quite often it is the domain of girls shoes the That's boys don't right, get the fun no. sparkling Boy, things boys get some fun things too and tell me about these local labels that you're really interested in for kids fashion at the moment well, i just think it's really nice to put some focus on some local new zealand labels so there's there's a there's a few out there that i love carbon soldier it does some really sort of fashion forward pieces. Uh, Pop Factory does some really good They're stuff. They're on screen that now. Is. That's right. Pop Factory does some stuff that's really design focus orientated. And then my favourite new label is It's My Triangle, which is sort of very streetwear focus with riffs a little bit on, on music humour as well. Um, oh, there they are. That's yes. really great. Oh, I love cute. those. Yeah. Once again, I say I would like to wear those things myself. Same. <laughs> So these are so, and it's also great to actually buy local clothes as well. Absolutely, Hope, helping local designers do well. Helping, helping our industry, helping our country. It's okay. great. I don't know why there was magic. You don't know why there's magic. magic. There's always magic. There's always magic. Asher in the studio. There's always magic. Hey Lee, it has been an absolute pleasure Thank having you. you in talking kids' fashion, and Excellent. we look forward to having you back sometime soon. Excellent. Now let's check in with Holly.